Hi, my name is Christopher Sprecher. Uh, I'm an American who's been living in Germany for the past five and a half years. I just completed my PhD in Byzantine history, and I've been uh, part of the Ar Armenian class this year at the Himal Summer School. I'm Pelin Kalafotoğlu İslamoğlu. I'm from Turkey, and um, uh, I'm studying at Koç University. I'm a PhD student. I'm Nathan Betts. I just finished my PhD in Leuven, Belgium, at the KU Leuven. My name is Plesson, George Babu. I'm from India. I'm doing my PhD at uh, the University of Göttingen in Germany in uh, the Faculty of uh, Philosophy of Religions. So my name is Virginia. I study at Birkenti University in Ankara, though I'm Italian. And my area of expertise is the region of Turabdin. My name is Aliash Kleins. Uh, I'm from Slovenia and I'm doing a joint doctoral degree in Islamic studies and Christian theology. I'm mainly focusing on the Quran and its and biblical context. In a short span of time, in just four weeks, I could see myself with, um, after this program, that uh, I have acquired the necessary skills with which I can now approach the manuscript. When you're handling these, these manuscripts, you really feel like you're touching history. You're really in conversation over time. Uh, despite time with uh, the people who have been so important in transmitting these things. And being someone who can say, I can actually look at Armenian text, something that deals with both historical things as well as theological controversies, uh, will definitely be a boost for my CV. This summer school program provides quite an opportunity in my future career, which is the possibility of actually um, access to, by myself one lion's share of the primary sources for the area I'm studying. I can maybe speak on behalf of um, my colleagues here. We, were, uh, we didn't have any other worries. We just concentrated uh, on our learning and studies. And, um, also, we had extracurricular uh, activities, uh, which also uh, helped us to decompress when we needed to in this intensive uh, language program. I think our students find this to be an exceptional place for language learning. They're surrounded by 2,700 acres of gorgeous nature. Minnesota in summer, of course, is like going off to camp or a resort, and particularly St. John's. But they're also influenced by the beautiful architecture and the, uh, the sense of history and presence that the Abbey provides. And so in a way, it's kind of a full package, so we can cater to um, outdoor interests, to aesthetic and artistic interests, and to spiritual as well. I think there are two types of opportunities that it provides me for my future career. The first is, of course, that I have now access to these primary texts that were written in Syriac, and I can quote them, and I can discuss them with, with other scholars who are doing, uh, who are researching like similar similar topics. And then another another um, another sort of opportunities is connected with the with the um, connections that I got here because like I, I, I met other scholars who are working in the same field and I discussed many uh, I discussed many issues with them and I think this can also help me in, in, in my future academic life.